All right, by doing this, Mike Sykes, Millionaire Maker. And with me, I'm making a millionaire. All right, so this is day 181 of my 365-day YouTube content creation challenge, where I challenge myself for the next 365 days to create valuable and useful content that I can post to my YouTube channel and try and bring the benefit of the knowledge that I gained over the last few years as an entrepreneur to somebody out here in the world, um, out here in the YouTube world, that might not know what it is that I know and might be looking for a place to start off. Okay, and well, you can come to my channel and watch some of my videos and probably get some guidance on what to do and where to go. Only work left for less than an hour today. My internet connection for some reason is not working this morning. It only worked for just this evening around eight others. The only thing I've done is reviewing the lead since there are plenty of do not calls, exporting no answers and voicemail leads done. Nine manual calls, one SN. Uh, I will start early tomorrow, boss, around 9 a.m. and work fully on, on Saturday. My apologies, boss. I think they were not done with their maintenance the other day. I'll make it up tomorrow. Thank you very much. Okay, that's her daily report. She logged in at 11, logged out at 12 noon. Okay. It's me checking. Uh, 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 okay. Me checking my emails. I think I need to go over here. Bank Wood Forest. Because that Okanaka Spanger came in. I don't know what it is. I made at Papa John's this week. Okay, Papa John's is giving me $111. Uh, Okanaka is going to come in. Pay Fleet Corps. That's $12 service charge. 111 coming in. Maybe at 221. Okay. Uh, mm, I need to be looking like, where's my next something pan? Amazon Kids to go to the card. QuickBooks, that's a deposit. Uh, leasing, Okanakas, that's going to be, so that should be coming through. That's going to be the next one. Roku channel. Um, needs to go see if I think I put that on the card. I believe I did. And if so, I'm good. Then we shouldn't have not much coming up out of here until for at least about a week or so. Okay. That's what I'm believing there. Um. I haven't been over here to look over here for a minute. But I'm going to come over here and have a look. Mm hmm Okay. Okay, I don't know what that is. DoorDash came. They gave me $67. So, I got to... Let's see. Um, you count it to 67 to 47. That's 114. And then it'll probably be the 23, 114. 14, 24, 34, 30, 137. 137 that I can possibly take maybe 100 and put it on something. Something's going to be coming up that I can use that hundred on to pay it off. Okay, that'll leave me at six ninety-seven. Okay, leave up out of here. Uh, go back over to here. All right, what I'm doing now is I'm checking a couple of my accounts because I do have a few accounts. I did see on a Google post, because I get a news feed on the phone, and they have different uh, blogs that you can read, and different posts that they think, okay, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5.7, 5
think just coming out of here is that's it. But it's still good. It looks better than nothing. But I was reading that and one of them was saying like, having four bank accounts is a good number. Yeah, I know their um, logic for having four bank accounts becomes um, have a bill account, have a savings account, have a spending account, and oh shit, God damn it, damn. There they go. See, what's going on is these damn fucking bugs. These fuck, oh Lord have mercy. We're gonna fight. Don't y'all. Oh Lord have mercy, I can't stand them. They get on my nerves. And I mean, they just like coming, a hundred of them, they just keep coming and coming and coming. And. I sweep them all up and I see a five more of them being that came in here. All right. Oh, Lord have mercy. Monthly service fee, $15. Now, that wasn't y'all, was it? I believe it. Okay. Uh, I did orders on from over here. Hired car gave me $67. Okay. Uh, check Navy Federal. He's already paid his rent, so we good. They are cheating all the fine on the 15th. All right, so I've checked my accounts. I'm only six minutes in. It's one o'clock. I'm kind of like tired. I don't have to work early tomorrow, but I need to get up. Because I need to go to the mechanic shop. He still ain't looked at the truck yet. Okay, the longer it takes somebody to look at the truck, the longer it takes. But the good thing about that is it allows her to be able to accumulate more money in the process. All right. So, depending on what it is, she might even be able to pay for it herself. Okay, and then... Uh, I'm trying to think of something. It's really not much I can report on the day because I'm really not in a talkative mood, okay? Mm. Uh, I don't know. I just go back in here. I'm going to go over here and go ahead and look at see something. I'm come in because people like, like, I got this in the mail today. This is like it. It's a nice postcard, okay? Uh, supposedly this is a picture of the house, the property at 1 Charleston Avenue, the property that I sold. Okay. But, um, one. I'm going to my properties and I can look over here for address for one. What do I get? Just get a couple of something. No, can I get a one? Okay, uh, C, H, A, one Charleston Avenue. Okay, yeah. That's the reason why, because if you look at it, I have the biggest idea why it says I own the property. Hmm. It's never been registered, I guess, and uh, and it shows that I paid no. Okay, gave her fifty-five. He got sixty. Uh, but it shows that I own the property. I wonder if they're going to send me taxes for it. <laughs> uh, is there link properties? Do I own link properties? No, just this one. Estimated value at that. I wonder if I can resell it. Uh, but they say she bought it. Uh, she bought it, but it ain't never been registered in her name. 
Oh, but what I was saying was, okay, it says, Dear property owner, I would like to buy your house for cash at 1 Charleston Avenue or any other properties you might own. No commission, pay. we pay the closing costs, no repairs, moving for assistance. And I guess this is a picture of him and his family on there. Okay, that's the total postcard. And like I said, it says over here, I'm guessing he live in McDonough. Okay, we got this picture off of Google. We have not driven by. Would you consider an offer on your property? Property owner, 8152 Magnolia. And then look at the back side. Like I said, that's going to be the house over there on 1 Charleston Avenue. Okay. Uh, matter of fact, don't go nowhere. Yeah, I'm trying to examine something right now. I had to get my phone. I want to see something. If I, if it, it might not even be in this phone. It might be in that phone over there. But it does have no. A two. <laughs> okay. Hi there. Can't talk, can't talk. Uh, okay, no. I'm trying to find, okay. Uh, what's this, can't talk? I'm interested in the property on uh, Highway 54. What is, What I'm doing is I'm looking at looking up an address one H I G H okay where'd it go H W Y H W Y Highway fifty four Okay, go back Highway fifty four What is Highway 54? Okay, let's try that one. All right, well, that's what we're gonna do. 1374 Highway 54. We're gonna see uh, what do we get. Highway 54, Red Deer County. Oh, Fayetteville. What is Highway 54, though? Mm. Highway 54, Fayetteville, F A Y E T T E V I. L L E Fayetteville. Still ain't getting this nothing. Got a Fayetteville. Oh, we're not getting nothing. Okay, let's do that. H I G H W. A Y Highway 54 West South. Okay. Mm. Let's see if we can see what we're looking at. What is Highway 54? Expand it. Uh, I don't. 
I say Tyrone Rose. What I'm doing is I'm looking at a map trying to see what Highway 54 is. Because uh, I'm going to be honest with you, don't none of this territory look familiar to me. None of it. I don't see nothing. Fayette Family Couch, Tyrone Road. I'm trying to think about Tyrone Road. South Sandy Creek Road, 54. Okay, well, I don't know, so I can close this. But I was looking at this property because this lady wanted it. Somebody was texting me about it. Fayetteville Property Holdings. On its history. Uh. Okay, now what I'm about to do at one o'clock in the morning is text this person Whoever it was, I'm just trying to find out who owns the property. And so we'll text them Benjamin B E N. Benjamin J R I V E R S. Capital R I V E R S. Yes. Benjamin J. Rivers. Uh, property details. They say Fayetteville Property and Holdings. Let me say. Fayetteville Property Holdings, LLC. Six nine zero nine Kingston Pike, number two o five, Knoxville, Tennessee. Three seven nine one nine. Okay, what I'm doing now is texting this to this person six nine zero nine Kingston Pike hashtag two o five. Knoxville, Tennessee, 37919. That's who it says owns this property. Okay. And this is the only property that it says that they own. Yep. Fairville Property and Holdings. And they've owned it for three years and three months. And they have owned the property for three years and three months. And I was just being nice and doing a favor for somebody. Don't even have the biggest idea who it is, but just gave me something to do <coughs> for a second to look up a property. Okay. Now, since now I've been like 20 minutes in, so I think what I'm going to do is... I'm going to end this video. Oh, I keep forgetting. Okay, yeah, today is the first. By being the first, I had to do my whole list. Oh, guess what? I didn't even finish. I stopped. Uh, I got distracted. See, though. I really didn't. It's all on this phone here. So, 
portfolio. Alright, am I in the portfolio section? Now I have to look for CeeLo. Okay. Come back over here. So we got CeeLo. Uh, yeah, we go up there. 608. Tab. CeeLo. What I'm doing is a little copying and pasting from my top list to my bottom list. Okay. Uh, whoops, wrong place. CeeLo is at 477. Okay. After CeeLo. Now, what I'm not going to do tonight is I'm not going to total it up. All right. And know what how much I have totally invested in it and then turn around and okay so what I'm gonna do is finish it off I got these two left to graph mm, oops come up here over here go back over here next is gonna be CeeLo then the graft up here to the graph get this how many shares is it I have copy put it down here there pays uh, tab it one base the graph has a dollar ninety nine one point nine nine enter after the graph what we got left New cipher. Yeah. New cipher. Copy. Tap it in right. It's new cipher. Which is 2.99. Then we go back up here to the cipher, which is six of them. Uh, copy. Put it down here. Paste it. Tap it. Then come back over here. Find out how much we got in cipher, which is 151. 1.51. to yeah, say here and uh, give us our total for this 432.29 432.29 all right that's sort of that's the end of what um we closed that on the crypto side today 432.29 for the July the 1st on our crypto, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 different cryptocurrencies for a total, a grand total of $432, okay? Now, as far as stocks go, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 18, 19 different stocks and a Dogecoin for a total investment of 
for right now, which is a total of $1,226. All right. That there is what the stocks is looking like for the end of close today. I think the, um, tomorrow is what? Friday. Right? Yeah, we get into Friday. We get into Friday. Last day. And then the next one will be Tuesday because the office is closed. And observant of the 4th of July, which is Sunday. Okay? So, with that being said, I've checked through everything that I possibly feel like checking right now. Only thing I haven't checked is hire car. Not understanding why my car is not being rented. You know, uh, especially being the holiday weekend. Okay? But like I said, I'm not going to stress about that. Everything happens in its own time for its own reason. So. All right. So, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm about tired, ready to go to bed so I can get up tomorrow. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Like I said, my name is Michael Sykes, Millionaire Maker. Hang with me, I'll make you a millionaire. I also forgot to tell y'all, hit the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. And if you made it this far, which I know you, if you made it this far, I appreciate it if you share this video with at least five people. Introduce my channel to at least five people. Help me out. I appreciate that. My name is Michael Sykes, Millionaire Maker. If you hang with me, I'll make you a millionaire. I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.